thank you all for coming. Um, a lot of people put a lot of hard work into uh, this weekend, but ultimately it's nothing without you guys. Uh, and there's a good crowd. Uh, we're going to have a really exciting uh, full day tomorrow and even the rest of the evening. Uh, it's going to be really exciting. I am excited for it, but my voice is pretty flat, I'm told. But it's going to be a good... <laughs> It's going to be a good weekend, and I'm really looking forward to it. So thank you all for coming. Uh, so mental health matters. Uh, we're all here for a conference about mental health. Um, so that word probably means something different to all of you. Uh, it's a pretty broad word, uh, pretty vague. Um, but the fact of the matter is we all have mental health, and everybody we know has mental health. A lot of people think, like, uh, I'm not sure if I have mental health. Does that mean that... I have a mental illness, like does that mean I'm depressed? No, we, we all have mental health just like we all have physical health. And so part of what we want you guys to experience this weekend is uh, to increase your own awareness about your mental health. Uh, you may not have any mental health issues, but you can still strive every day to be healthy mentally and to reach your optimal level of mental health. So that's something that we really want to uh, expose you guys to and let you guys appreciate and understand this weekend. Um, so that's one reason why you're all here, and it's great that you're all here in the auditorium, and again, we have a, a good couple of days planned. But something I want you guys to think about over the next 24 hours and when you get home uh, is why, why are you here? Why are you sitting in this auditorium right now? And why are you in your seat, but the person who sits in math class next to you isn't here right now? And you may not know the answer right away, and you may know exactly why you're here. Uh, we all have our reasons for being here. I have my reason for being here, just as you guys all have your own reason. So you may know now, it may be something you learn in a workshop tomorrow, or something you learn uh, the night you get home and you're lying in bed and it hits you. Uh, but the reason why we're all here is I think what's going to make this conference a success. Not just tonight, not just tomorrow, but when you get home for days and weeks and months and years to come. So I, I, I challenge you guys to think about that. Why is it that you are here? Why are you really here? Um, so we have a great weekend in store. Uh, we're going to have a really good play uh, tonight called Give Me Back. I saw it in October, and I just knew that we had to uh, get it into a school. So I think you guys will really enjoy that. Uh, we have lots of guest speakers. We've had a lot tonight and some good keynote presentations to come tomorrow morning. Uh, as Louise mentioned, we have um, a Mental Health Commission of Canada Headstrong Summit happening simultaneously with our conference, so that's pretty exciting. We have a lot of stuff going on here this weekend. Uh, you've all signed up for workshops, which you'll participate in tomorrow. Um, and then tomorrow afternoon, uh, which is what I'm most looking forward to, we have our, our breakout creative planning sessions. In your programs, it's called Tomorrow Matters. I'm really looking forward to that part of the conference. It's when you guys will meet uh, based on uh, geographically where you're from. So everyone from Western will get together and everyone from Central will get together and Justin will join you guys. And uh, it's, it's a time when you guys can get together and all night tonight and all mo morning, tomorrow morning, you'll be learning and hearing all sorts of things. And we've got three hours allocated for you guys to really process it. What does it mean to you? to really understand what you've learned and think about how you're going to use that when you get back home. Because that's the other half of what we want to expose you guys to here and encourage you guys to do. Uh, experience the conference, enjoy it. It's a full weekend. But then really focus on like what change can you bring home? And Justin's going to give a great, great presentation about that tomorrow afternoon. Uh, so that's the other half of our mandate, to give you guys something tangible to bring home. Uh, so we have a full weekend. Uh, you guys are going to learn about your own mental health. You're going to learn about the mental health of others, and hopefully we're going to encourage and inspire you guys to bring something home and keep the conversation going. Our motto is from a whisper to a scream, and that's what we hope to accomplish with, uh, in regards to the conversation around mental health. So thank you guys all for being here. It really does mean a lot, and I would like to also thank everyone who put in so much hard work to making this weekend happen. It's sort of an extrapolation from an event we had in November, and it's just riding the wave of uh, the momentum regarding mental health, uh, which has been sort of taking over this province over the past year. It's great to, been a, to be a part of it, and we're really excited to be here, but I can't take any of the credit, honestly. It goes all back to you guys here, the people backstage, uh, everyone in our steering committee who put in a lot of work for months now to make this happen. 
Our administration from the school has been extremely supportive. We've got a lot of uh, support from government and organizations, so it's, it's a really special moment to see all of this materialize and come to fruition, and uh, I'd like to thank everyone who, uh, who made it happen. And I would especially like to thank uh, Debbie House, who is the co-chair, uh, along with myself, for this conference. And I'm not sure where Debbie is right now. I was going to call her up, but uh, I don't think she would like that. But if you see her this weekend, uh, definitely uh, say thank you, because she put a lot of hard work into this. And uh, she made this weekend was going to be a great experience for all of us. And like Justin said, if you ever feel like holding back this weekend, do the opposite. We have a short amount of time here, but it's going to be really concentrated and full of excitement and positivity. So enjoy it, make the most of it, and I look forward to spending the next couple of days with you guys. Thank you.